Hello everyone, hello! Sasare back with more Final Fantasy XIV. We're gonna be doing the level 54 ninja quest here. Possibly the level 56, though I am only level 55 right now, so we shall see. That said, we will be gaining some EXP nonetheless. Welcome back, Miro. You may enter. You got, guys recall, we are helping uh, the princess of uh, one of the Ora tribes regain her items, although she's not want to get help from the shinobi. Akagi has called us again, this time to Ashan's embrace. His note was brief and hastily written. I do not know what the princess has done, but it is clear she needs our aid urgently. Right, I forget what that is. Uh, Lord Lanas. Oh, it's at the bridge. Okay. So like I said, off stream tonight, I'm probably going to be going to get the uh, uh, those quests in uh, Quartzless Islands done. I'll also do many of the ones in uh, Germanian Forelands. Shouldn't take too long, I would think. You forgot about Rod N? Yeah, you'll be fine. You can fight Rod N. Just remember to pass the debuff or whatever. I think that was that fight. You! Where were you? Here I am, worried half to death because the princess is in danger and I can't do a thing about it! And you just sawed her up like, like... Calm yourself. Instead at the beginning, where is the princess? C calm? Alright, oh, calm. Her highness learned about who bought the clan's jewel. She ran off to get... Uh, she's run off to get take it back and... Where is she? She can't have gotten far, even with her bleeding witchcraft or, or whatever. Come on, let's fan out and find her! Well, that's it in a nutshell. The guards won't rest till they catch her, and she's stuck up there. <laughs> that she would find the Jade Jewel is just like her, but she clearly has no way to escape. Well, Miro, it is your mission. What takes the greatest priority? Helping the princess. An answer that befits the true shinobi. The guards think the princess ninjutsu is magic. We can use this ignorance to our benefit. Let's fly right on. They will mistake the thunder for Princess Yuki's ninjutsu. Draw the enemy southwest, away from the princess. We will warn rendezvous on the salt strand. There's AoE and heal through and rage. That's hilarious. The sound of footsteps echoes in the distance. That sound! It's the girl! After her! Sound of footsteps echoes in the distance. Come on! What do you mean, no? Cowards, do you want to be the one to tell the master someone took the jewel? Then come on! Hey, under the bridge. Don't let her get away! The jewel's more valuable than our lives! That's a problem, guys. When you start believing a fucking jewel is more valuable than your own lives. There's some problems there. Alright. Hello, hello, princess! Oh, you are unexpected. Yes, most unexpected. 
so the thunder wasn't her doing, but a shinobi's. Huh, most curious. Where did she find the coin to pay you? Well, she command your loyalty with her regal blood. What? I could do if royalty flowed in my veins. No matter, I'm buying a bright future with my actions today. The mission comes first, as they used to say. I was only paid to oversee the delivery, but it is my employer's goodwill worth, I wonder. Why do you look at me like that? Your eyes are like Karasu's or Gekai's, judging me unworthy. You must be from the Far East. A real shinobi with real ninjutsu, like Gekai. You think yourself my better because of it? Don't lie to me! I can see it in the, your cl damn eyes. It will make you... I'll, I will make you spit out what you know about Yuki. Or I'll cut it from your corpse's stomach. Oh, uh, okay. I don't know what my stomach holds. That's uh, gonna tell you why anything I know it there, but sure. Okay. Unexpected. I'll just have to use what he taught me. However, the disagreeable thought. Oh, hang on. Forbid my Mudra summoning too? the old buck that, uh... I know when the tide is turned, he who fights and runs away. Yes, yes. Why do they always run? He spoke of Gekai and Karasu, but who was he? Oh, but who was he? Oh. Huh. I like this area. It's, it makes for a good fight area. Fights area. Like a backdrop. A different breed than the other guards, that one. He knew of Kurasu, of Gekai. There's n there should be no shinobi in this land with such knowledge. Unless he was one of Gekai's shadows. The Imperial Shinobi lost their place in Garlemog when the unit was disbanded after the man's death. That would be cause for them to sell their blades. I imagine the demand for mercenaries with ninjutsu would be great among people with money enough to trade in Far Eastern treasures. Pardon me, Miro, this can wait. Princess Yuki's safety is paramount. Let us join her near the Tempest Gate. Up we go. On westerly winds. Ashan's embrace. We really like that we can just like skip over all of that over there and just fly here now. Yes, Ak Akagi told me, and no, your aid was not needed. I could have escaped perfectly well without you. But I suppose the important thing is that I made the, the Jade Jewel is once again mine. All I've left to find is the Midari Kanamitsu dagger. Don't interfere! This this is my problem to solve, alright? Never know about what she said, but she's secretly grateful. And if she does, And if she does anything, I'll know where to find her brave protectors. That you do. Shall we return, Miro? Alright. 
So if this levels me up, which I suspect it should, we will be able to do the level 56 quest. Hey, Bob Dole. So what I might do uh, off uh, tomorrow is I don't quite feel up to doing mirror dies to this, so I might uh, still do a stream tomorrow night. And instead of doing mirror dies to this, I think I might uh, just do a side quest stream of this, where we're playing uh, through, and I'll, I'll level up my uh, my black mage and my uh, I'll unlock conjurer. I have made Akagi aware of the strange cell sword we met on the salt strand. He will be vigilant, as should you. As for your mission, I believe the princess is warming to you, though it is difficult to tell. But at the very least, no harm had be has befallen her on your watch. Now, I will leave you to your meditations. Allow them to come uh, to further sharpen your mind, so you will be the blade when the time comes to strike. There we go. Okay. So this should level us up, and we're going to learn uh, Armor Crush, which is, um, instead of being behind the enemy for an alien strike, we've got to be on the enemy's flank. And uh, what this does is it... In, um, Add 30 seconds to our Hutan ability, so we don't have to keep recasting Hutan with our Mudras. Alright, so this one's going to teach us Dream Within a Dream and Adept Assassination. So, basically, it upgrades Assassination to Dream Within a Dream, which I didn't know that. It never used to do that. Uh, it used to be... Um, you had both of these, I'm pretty sure. Medieval Espionage. Miro, Jack's network has caught wind of whom, uh, who has been selling the Yatsuragi clan's stolen treasure. This information may, uh, uh, that may lead us to straight to the dagger. He has summoned us both to the guild, but could I ask you to go by yourself? I cannot leave just now. Akagi and Princess Yuki are on their way here. I sent a message of telling them that we might have information on the bandits who robbed her. The princess desires to learn more of them, and so she has seen fit to join us. I believe Jack will give you a thread. Follow it, and return once you have unraveled the truth. Alright, let's go back to Linsa Laminsa. Okay, so, uh, we gotta go to the guild. Linsa Laminsa Fisherman's Guild is the closest. Again, Jack, you could have just met us here or called us via Link Pearl. I'm sure you have my number. I don't know how Link Pearls work, to be honest. Can everybody who's on the Link Pearl here? Funnily enough, guys, when I first played through uh, Heaven's Ward, I was a ninja. So it's cool to uh, play through this again as a ninja. Nero! Gods! No, it ain't simple to make Black Marketers talk, but we tickled Mulfakelpa's neck with a stabber, and he coughed up a load of information. The remaining bauble, a dagger by all accounts, is to be sold at auction, and attendance is invitation only. The hosts are a band what got, uh, go by the name of the True Hounds. Now, in the eyes of the law, they're selling loot cloyed from Imperials on an expedition to the Far East. But Garlemald don't control where your dimmers morts from. It's a Benny memory turning a profit under the guise of a proper company. The buyers won't ask too many questions either. Grabbed or no, treasure is treasure. But it's just your princess wit against the true hounds. The guild can't act on that, not officially anyway. I've left the investigations to a, well, let's call him a black marketeer. He's a strange one. Only came to the guild attention recently, but I've never met a cove who couldn't get information so quickly. The veil was lifted by a southerly this morn. That'll put the man in the house of sticks. Here's a sack of blood. Benny left the mess. Last. All right, he's there. Uh, it actually might be faster just to go to the uh, to the um, which gate is this? Middle one, Asia. Middle one, Asia. Gary has the worst timing to call. I mean, Gary just likes to talk to you. Mira's laying with her duck right now. She looks very cute.
Mira, mini cat, mini cat, Mira. Middle Lanasia. I don't think she ever lost it. I think she knew where it was the whole time. I think she's just quite cruel and sadistic and uh, keeps the duck locked up in pur purgatory. Guys are flying over to the House of Sticks. Naturally, he's going to have his guards. information then come render to me with his mind sack of gill if you had a sack of gill for every time someone entrusted you with a sack of gill you would need a bigger sack hmm. hmm yes yes this seems to be everything i was promised the back alleys are awfully profitable eh now about these true hounds most of the salt hounds crawled back to the land after the calamity, but a few refused to leave the seas and took up against uh, again as the true hounds. They sail under the black flag of one Captain Rosalind. They boast the strength of a crew twice their size, mostly because of uh, the Pluto they take. With their muscle bolstered by the substance and a healthy dose of natural viciousness, they have brought themselves fortune and infamy on the eastern seas. Now, however, they've hidden their ship away on a hullbreaker isle and made their way to Costa del Sol. Seems they fancied a cup of ale and peek at the dancing girls. They won't be hard to spot if you want to look, but do so at your own peril. Drunken pirates might not frighten you, but Redway, their new sellsword, should. They say he's an ex-member of Garley in uh, covert operations, one who has thrown himself into the study of ninjutsu. His pursuit has paid off handsomely, albeit at the lack of his humility. Stay vigilant or you'll find his blade pricking your back. Anyhow, that's all for me. Give my best to the dim one, little chick. <laughs> oh. Oh, I wonder who that could have been. You have a deep scratch across your wrist from Stinky this morning? Something startled when he jumped up and backlaw went across your wrist. <laughs> that got your attention. I can imagine. At least it wasn't on purpose. I have a couple of claw marks on my finger here from Mira catching me when I'm playing with her. But that's that's the risk of playing with, with the mini cat. She still hasn't learned that she doesn't need to use her claws for every action she does. Redway, Redway, Redway. I lost me plunder. That's coin I may never get back. But you convinced me to give you time. Make your report with me a while, or I'll have your head. There were two thieves, Captain. The Iron Orchid herself and some servant. The latter looks to be a more brawny than brave, but the princess is dangerous. She has two shinobi in her employ. One is a Domen Jonin, Oboro. He too is a force to be weaponed with. The other is a here, Miro, if I'm not wrong. She is famous in her own right and dangerous. Their involvement makes me think the princess has no has more coin than she lets on. These two are responsible for my master's death. Their services cannot be cheap. Your master's murderers, eh? You wouldn't be dreaming of avenging Gekai on my time now, would you? Vengeance, Captain, why? Gekai treated me like scum. He and Karasu both. Because I wasn't from their precious little village. But Obero. If I triumph over Gekai's favorite, I triumph over a lot of them. That is my heart's desire, yes. I could give a gnat's arse what you do with the ninjas, but it's not them I want. 
It's the princess. Alive. The way I see it, the auction's the perfect trap. Baited as it is with the Yatsurugi's dagger. The Iron Orchid can't resist. Catching her will be that'll be easy and fast, savvy, Redway. Of course, of course. The princess won't stand a chance with the guard doubled. No, she won't. That man's using the daggers I got from the uh, stone vigil. Jeremy wants to have sex with her? The the captain of, uh, of, the, of the pirates? I mean, you, you saw her. She's a good-looking lady. Don't you? That is quite the scratch, dudes. That is quite the scratch. Anyway, dudes, you never told me. What do you think of my hat? Welcome back, Nero. You may enter. Success, Nero. Hmm, Miss Rosalind is a clever one, spying upon us through Redway. Princess, the foe will be watching for our tricks now. Reclaiming the last treasure will be that much harder, so I beg you, leave it to us, Shinobi. I know there's sense in what you say, Obero, but this is my problem. I alone must solve it. And I, I will not allow more people to die in my name. The true hounds didn't just steal my treasures. My people stood in their way, and many died. Too many. I wanted to fight, but my vassals wouldn't allow it, and as they were cut down, they called for me, screamed my name. You can't imagine how that feels. My lands are so close to destruction. My people are on the brink of starvation. If I do not do something, all of their sacrifices will mean nothing. When I came here, I vowed that I would bring prosperity to my country by finding and selling my treasures. Alone, no one would ever die protecting me again. Not my small folk, not my vassals, nor you. You don't want anyone to die protecting you, princess. What about those of us who would die and give our lives willingly to defend you? If you won't trust in the shinobi, then, then I, I'll slice open my belly. I'm bound to you, princess, but they're not. We've given them no coin, no gratitude, and yet they're still helping us. You can trust them. You have to. Or there's no taking back the treasure. Trust the shinobi or lose me and add one more to those who died trying to protect you. That'll get you to stop, right, P princess? <laughs> Akagi, you have the strangest whip. Clearly the shinobi have left a great impression upon you. Obero, Miro, consider this my formal request. Help me retake our last treasure. But I have one condition. No matter what happens, you will not lay down your lives for mine. Call it a duty to stay alive, if you wish. Stay alive. Hmm. An interesting notion. Shinobi are trained to put duty ahead of all else, including our lives. That said, Miro, this is the mission that has been given to you. You are duty-bound to see it through. And come what may, I know that completing it will aid you in your growth as a shinobi. Now we wait and watch for signs of the auction. I will approach Jack with the eyes and ears of his service. We will spread a web and so catch word of Yatsurugi's clan dagger. Alright, that's that's actually it. Very easy. In perfect devotion to your duty, you now awaken a new technique. Dream within a dream. Alright, so the next quest actually doesn't give us anything. It's just story for this, so... Let's go outside and use Dream Within a Dream. 
So before, with assassinate, uh, you jump on the thing and stab the enemy. Uh, here. Can I use it on this? Uh, oh, the dummy's not there. Okay. Let's use it on this uh, dun mage swarm. So you just walk up and let's uh, see if we can get a good view of this. Okay, watch. Just a quick triple slash. All I remember about Dream of Dream with the Dream is you push it during Trick. Yeah, so I think now the best time to use it is during Trick and uh, Mug if you can have both up. But since these have like two separate recast times, you would just use it during... So first you'd use it during both of them, then you'd use it during Trick, and then you'd use it during both of them again. You don't know any animations or graphics in the game? That's not good. Uh, I don't like Raiju, uh, Forked Raiju either. I, I, I don't like how it works. Uh, it looks cool, but that's about it. Um, I abandoned Ninja long before that, uh, just due to Tenchi Jin. Fortunately, I don't have to worry about Tenchi Jin since we got Ninja for Heavensward. Anyway, guys, uh, that's going to be it for today's stream. 